County clerks all over the state are preparing for Michigan's presidential primary. This will be the first election for early voting. Here in Muskegon, they were testing the tabulators to get ready. One by one, 3,000 test ballots run through the Muskegon County's voting machines. Some are even filled out wrong. Maybe people mark too many candidates for the position. To make sure the machines catch the error, probate judge Gregory C. Pittman and Muskegon County Clerk Karen Bowie helped with the test run. We want to make sure that every situation is addressed, every ballot issue. And so it's important that we make sure that all the ballots from all the jurisdictions are run through our machines and making sure that they're programmed correctly. A process where accuracy is essential and every ballot counts. It's just tabulating. It's not um, doing anything. It's not making any markings. It's just tabulating the, the ballot and keeping count of how many ballots come through. This is, uh, I think, as much as you can possibly do to help ensure to people that the accuracy, the fairness, the veracity of our elections is protected. Judge Pittman hopes making this process public puts any concerns to rest. So this is a process that helps hopefully diminish the level of misinformation, increase the level of accurate information, and thereby ensure that everybody feels good about what it is we do on election days. And with early voting kicking off for the first time in Michigan, Bowie wants people to know they're ready. We're excited about it. Um, we have no idea how many um, voters will take advantage of it, but we'll be here. We want to make sure that the community is totally comfortable with the election process and that they understand that there were numerous security procedures put in place to make sure that our elections are safe and secure. Early voting in person for the presidential primary must begin on February 17th, and election day is February 27th. But you can also request an absentee ballot through your local clerk's office. In Muskegon, Darren Bauer, Fox 17 News. Many Michiganders are voting absentee in this month's presidential primary. According to the Secretary of State's office, nearly 1.3 million absentee ballots have already been requested. That's an 80% increase when compared to the three weeks leading up to the 2020 presidential primary. Absentee voting is underway and early in-person voting begins statewide on the 17th. Election day is Tuesday the 27th.